Hey guys, today on this video I'll be telling you how to make an item giver. So I'll show you how it works. So let's go and play the game. Um, I'm gonna mute the volume. And if I click this, I'll have the tool. And I could click the more and just like spam and spam like out of nowhere. So, so I'll show you how to do that anyways. And then another thing like, yeah, whatever. So first of all, you put your tool in the server storage and then you make a part and I'm gonna, you could just leave it here. You make a part. So let's just do another, like another item giver. So here's a part. I'm gonna, so, and then you have to insert a click detector, then insert a script in the part. And go to server storage and put your tool over here at the server storage, and uh, and it and you need a script. So yeah, whatever. Let's just yeah. So let's go and make a uh, event. So this is the event you have to uh, yeah. You have to write. So I'm just gonna copy this to make it a little shorter. Um, Okay, so now let's put the end. Now I'm gonna copy this, and this is actually a very short tutorial because I'm copying. Um, so let's paste. Now let's, yeah, so if you're done doing this, I'm gonna put a spawn. Um, now let's go and play the game. There's so many plugins that's on today. Okay, there we go. My plugin is off now. And yeah. So here's this. I'm gonna click it. Now it'll it'll yeah. But I'm gonna show you more about the scripting. So you in so first you insert a part, now insert a click detector and script. Then you make, put the tool in the server storage if you already make it. So script.parent.clickdetector.mosclick connect function play. So so I define I define the click detector. I don't know how to pronounce it really properly. And I put player so the script knows that the player do it, not other people, not other no not uh, yeah like yeah just players. So local item equals equals game dot server storage. So game the whole game dot server storage. This server the service here, and the tool the tool in the server that's the child, and clone. So yeah, item dot parent equals player dot backpack. So pack pack is the inventory. In the in the player inventory, in the game inventory, not the Roblox inventory, not the normal one, but the yeah Roblox player inventory. So you made an event of what happened if you if you um get the part if you um click it with the click detector. So I define it. Then I make a variable and and this variable is game. It's about the tool. That's the child of the server storage, and the item, the item parent, will be the play backpack. So, so the backpack will be, will be the parent of this of the item. It's a variable, so you can put anything. You could just write here anything. So I'm just gonna put tool. It's it's blue on. There's blue underscore because it's not the same, so I need to write tool. So tool dot parent equals player backpack. So that's more about the script. So yeah. Also, there's another one here. We could also add even more tools. So yeah, let's just um duplicate this thing, and I'm gonna name this um hey tool like a hey or whatever. And it's gonna and and it's gonna be hey instead. And here it will be tool. So let's test that out. Let's play the game. 
So, yeah, let's just wait for it. Uh, wait a minute. Wait a sec. I need to yeah, turn off all my plugins. I wonder why when every time I play, when I, every time I test Roblox Studio, plugin comes up, my GUI plugin comes up. So, here we go. Uh, it's a hey, and this one, a tool. Okay, so it's, it should be, uh, it should be here. Yep, yeah, it's here. But, you know, if you delete it, we will lose our tool. That's the interesting part I actually found out. So that's funny. Okay, I could just get a lot of tool spamming. Yeah. Now that's how we make a tool giver. If this helped, make sure to subscribe and like. And if you want other more tutorial I could make. Oh, also. I'm soon I'm gonna make an animation button so if you click it it will play an animation I remember that I found out someone in the comments says how to yeah saying that he she it's a I think it's a girl and she wants to she wants me to make a video and animation button so I must say it'll take a long time for me to find out how because I don't actually know how yet so yeah, I'll see you next time.